Hi, my name is Darcy Andrews. I'm with Classroom Support, which is part of CITL. I'd like to take a few moments to show you some of the technology you can find in classrooms around campus. And now, let's get started. The first thing you'll need to look at is the control system. In this particular classroom, it's actually a touchscreen interface where you'll have the control for the projector power. You'll have your different input selections as to which one is going to display on the projector. And then you have a master volume control for all of those. You'll find in some rooms as well, it may be a button-based control interface, but the fundamentals are the same. You'll still have a projector control, your input selection, as well as your master volume. One of the examples I'm going to show you now is the document camera. This comes in really handy when you want to use it as a writing surface. When you want to show some printed text. Or you want to showcase some three-dimensional objects. Next, we have the desk PC. You're going to want to log into that PC with your MUN credentials, and that's going to get you access to the desktop and internet access and software you'll find on that machine. And if you wish to use your own device, such as a laptop or a tablet, we'll have cabling available for you. If any of these cables don't work for you, you'll need to get the appropriate adapter and supply that yourself. And here's how you'd basically plug in. And that's it. We also have a dedicated player in case you want to play back any DVDs or Blu-rays or any disc-based media you might have. And if you're in a classroom that's larger than normal that might require amplification of your voice, we have wireless lapel microphones that'll be available in those spaces. And if you have any issues while you're teaching in the classroom, on every desk we have our contact information, so you can reach out to us and we'll come assist you immediately. And if you want any demonstrations of this equipment, or if you have any questions or concerns, or if you have any requests of things you'd like to do in the classroom, feel free to reach out to us on our website. Thanks for your time.